A Spiritual Heritage in Abrahamic Faiths In the vast religious texts that have shaped human spirituality, few figures stand as prominently as Prophet David, known in the Islamic tradition as Dawood. Revered across Judaism, Christianity, and Islam, David's life, and his divinely revealed scripture, the Zabur, offer a profound insight into the essence of faith, leadership, and moral integrity. Imagine a young shepherd who rose to defeat a giant with nothing but a sling and unwavering faith, who then became a king and a prophet, guiding his people with wisdom and songs of praise. The Zabur, a collection of these sacred hymns and teachings, continues to resonate through the ages, intertwining the spiritual lives of millions across different faiths and highlighting the timeless pursuit of divine wisdom and justice. At this juncture, I request you not to forget to subscribe the channel after watching the video. The Zabur is a pivotal holy book in Islamic tradition, revealed to the prophet David, Dawood. This text, deeply respected in Islam, is often equated with the Psalms of the Hebrew Bible and is considered one of the four main Islamic holy books alongside the Torah, Taurat, the Gospel, Injil, and the Quran. The Quran mentions the Zabur several times, describing it as a book of divine wisdom and guidance bestowed upon David, a significant figure whose life and legacy warrant a detailed exploration. David, known in Arabic as Dawood, is a prophet and king whose life story is woven into the religious narratives of Judaism, Christianity, and Islam. According to Islamic tradition, David was a devout servant of God, chosen to lead the Israelites and guide them towards righteousness. His early life was marked by his humble beginnings as a shepherd, a profession that imbued him with qualities of patience, resilience, and a deep connection to nature and God's creation. David's rise to prominence began with his legendary encounter with Goliath, Jalut, a giant warrior who terrorized the Israelites. With unshakable faith and a simple sling, David defeated Goliath, demonstrating that divine power and trust in God can overcome even the most daunting obstacles. This victory not only elevated David's status among his people, but also exemplified his unwavering belief in God's support and justice. As a king, David's reign was characterized by his pursuit of justice, wisdom, and devotion to God. He established a strong and united kingdom, centered in Jerusalem, which became a spiritual and political hub. David's leadership was not only marked by military and political achievements, but also by his profound spiritual insights and moral integrity. The Zabur, revealed to David, is a testament to his deep spirituality and his role as a conduit of divine wisdom. While the exact contents of the Zabur in Islamic tradition are not fully detailed, it is understood to be a collection of hymns, praises, and spiritual teachings. These texts are seen as expressions of David's devotion, his reflections on the nature of God, and his guidance for living a righteous and faithful life. The Zabur emphasizes themes such as the importance of worship and praise of God, trust in divine justice, personal repentance, and moral integrity. It encourages believers to seek God's mercy, reflect on their actions, and strive for righteousness. David's recitation of the Zabur was renowned for its beauty and spiritual depth, capturing the hearts of his followers and strengthening their faith. The initial followers of the Zabur were the Israelites, who revered David as both a prophet and a king. They adhered to the teachings of the Zabur, which provided them with spiritual guidance and a framework for moral conduct. Over time, the influence of the Zabur extended beyond the Israelites, permeating the broader Abrahamic traditions. Today, the direct followers of the Zabur as a distinct religious group do not exist. However, the teachings and hymns of the Zabur have been integrated into the religious practices of Jews, Christians, and Muslims. In Judaism, the Psalms, which correspond to the Zabur, are an integral part of liturgy and prayer, reflecting the continued relevance of David's spiritual legacy.
In Christianity, the Psalms are a key component of the Old Testament, widely used in worship and liturgical services. Muslims respect the Zabur as one of the holy books revealed by God, acknowledging its role in the continuum of divine revelation and honoring its teachings that align with Islamic principles. Towards the conclusion of the video, I again remind you to like, share, comment, and ASO subscribe the channel. In conclusion, the Zabur, revealed to Prophet David, remains a significant part of the religious heritage of the Abrahamic faiths. David's life, marked by his unwavering faith, leadership, and spiritual insight, continues to inspire believers. The hymns and teachings of the Zabur, though not preserved as a standalone text today, influence the worship practices and moral guidance of Jews, Christians, and Muslims, contributing to a rich tapestry of shared spiritual heritage. Thank you for watching.